Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Data speeds low to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for modems. See store for more details. The recent bitter cold temperatures are behind us for now, but the temperature effects on water systems locally are now becoming more evident. The Mountain Water District in Pike County has issued a conservation advisory due to depleting water reserves. District Manager Roy Sawyer said the problem is due to water line breaks resulting from the recent cold weather, as well as steps taken by customers to keep their pipes from freezing. You may have leaks on the customer side, we may have leaks at the base itself, or we may have a leak going into the base. It's mostly those type of lines that are freezing and, 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 and busting off on us or on the customer side. And when it does, it's just run out on the ground. So we have a problem with storage capacity and uh, trying to keep everybody in water. Sawyer said outlying areas of Pike County will likely experience the worst of the effects of the water problems. We will run into some areas where we have high volume outage and those areas will probably be re in reference to uh, head of Elkhorn Creek, Dorton area, uh, Beef Hide, Douglas, and probably, uh, as of right now, probably Marbon. Those areas we anticipate between today and tomorrow uh, maybe having some issues. He said the district has nearly three dozen crew members on the road responding to the problems, but with the water system having more than 18,000 meters, the response is taking some time. It has cost the district a lot over time, and, and uh, it's been very difficult for their staff because, you know, you're talking about working in 10-degree weather, 5-degree weather, getting wet and so forth, and our guys have been great about doing it. Uh, uh, that's one thing I can say about the district's personnel staff. We got a staff that really wants to serve their community and, and uh, they have the personality and attitude to get it done. In the meantime, Sawyer's urged anyone with information on leaks to contact the water district immediately. Sawyer said the warmer temperatures forecast for later this week could worsen the problems the district is already facing. In Pike County, Chris Anderson, EKB News.